Every day we wake up to the gentle embrace of sunlight, a reassuring presence in our lives. But have you ever considered that the very star we depend on for life will one day be the cause of our demise? Beyond its warm glow lies a chilling narrative of stellar evolution, and it's a story that spells doom for Earth. To understand the sun's eventual role as Earth's eventual killer, we must first look into the science of stellar evolution. Stars, including our sun, go through a natural life cycle that spans billions of years. Our sun is currently in the middle of its main sequence phase, where it fuses hydrogen into helium in its core, creating the energy that sustains life on Earth. This phase has lasted for about 4.6 billion years, and will continue for another 5 billion or so. As the sun ages, it will eventually run out of hydrogen to fuse in its core. When this happens, it will undergo a dramatic transformation. The sun will expand into a red giant, ballooning to a size so immense that it could engulf the inner planets, including Earth. Imagine our sun as an overinflated balloon, radiating an intense red glow. This phase will mark the beginning of the end for our planet. As the sun expands, it will cause extreme changes in Earth's climate, rendering it uninhabitable. Oceans will boil, and the surface will be scorched by the sun's intense heat. The fate of our sun after its red giant phase is still a subject of scientific debate. Some scientists believe it will undergo a less dramatic transition into a white dwarf, gradually cooling and fading away over billions of years. However, there's another, more spectacular possibility on the horizon, a supernova explosion. Although it's unlikely, if our sun were to explode as a supernova, it would be a cosmic spectacle like no other. Supernovae are some of the most powerful events in the universe, releasing more energy in a few weeks than our sun will emit over its entire lifetime. The explosion would be visible from galaxies far, far away, painting the sky with an otherworldly brilliance. If our sun doesn't go out with a supernova bang, it will go out with a whimper. After the red giant phase, the sun will shed its outer layers, creating a beautiful cosmic nebula. What remains is a dense core known as a white dwarf. White dwarfs are the remnants of stars like our sun. They're incredibly hot and dense, but no longer able to support nuclear fusion. Over eons, they gradually cool and fade away, eventually becoming cold, dark, and unremarkable space relics. However, there's another possibility. Our sun could become a black hole. To do this, it would need to acquire a significant amount of mass from another nearby star, which is a rare occurrence. Then, this supermassive sun would need to collapse in on itself, forming a black hole. The chances of our sun becoming a black hole are exceedingly slim, and even if it did, it wouldn't pose a direct threat to Earth. Black holes only devour matter that ventures too close, and Earth's orbit would remain far beyond that danger zone. Regardless of whether our sun ends as a white dwarf, a black hole, or simply fades away, Earth's fate is sealed. Without the sun's warmth and light, our planet will plunge into eternal darkness and cold. In the absence of the sun, Earth will freeze, with temperatures dropping to hundreds of degrees below freezing. The atmosphere will dissipate into space, leaving the surface exposed to the harsh vacuum of space. Life, as we know it, will cease to exist. The once teeming biosphere will become a barren wasteland. Our magnificent blue planet will transform into a desolate, frozen tomb, drifting silently through the void of space.